I guess this would be part two on that tip thing. If you've seen the tip video, you've seen where I made the kerosene lamp, which it works. I made a bracket today, which just comes down, bends out, has a hose clamp, comes back for support, and goes up underneath to hold the bottom of the bottle. It's easily removed. That's what the bracket looks like. I just kind of rigged it, but it's way stronger than it really needs to be because that's actually a thick ass piece of metal. And just set that sucker right there. <clears throat> I'll probably drill another hole down here so I can mount it here and up here. But there it is. Cursing lamp. Put it in the kitchen. I've got two in the living room. I figured one in the kitchen would give some light in here. Of course, it's course adjustable you turn the light down turn the light up of course the wick don't ain't very long so you get down a little while it ain't going to freaking run but honestly it's just something quick and easy to do because hey can't really find many bottles that fit that thread up there so i had to modify stuff um one experiment, future experiments may have me building other weird kerosene lamps considering you can pick up the top and the globes fairly cheap. Hey, I might even make some of the Walmart kerosene lamps where they can mount on the walls too. All right, I'm gone. Mr. 76 Aspen signed out.